Um, girls, I'm back. I went to uh, Dollar Tree. I told you I was really going to go. So I had to do it. It was so hot. I'm going to put some lipstick on. I don't know why, but... Oh, I got a lipstick at Dollar Tree. Let's try it. First off, I got this cute little box. Remember I said I was going to put my uh, earrings that have uh, posts on them and backs? I'm going to put them in here. So that is a cute little box. $1.25. Put it over there. Well, you all know I have a sweet tooth. So I got me some Crunch and Munch. <laughs> Now, I didn't get the box of 14, so uh, don't be mad at me. I got the Hostess Cupcake one. And, of course, I got the Yellow Zinger one. $1.25. And look at this cute cup glass I found for my big old iced tea. That's good. I don't know why I quit drinking iced tea. Now, I wanted to talk to you about this. I was going to talk to you about it tomorrow, but I'm going to hit and talk to you about it today. Now, I don't have it today. I really have a problem with sour tongue. I think it's because I eat so much sourdough bread. I only eat sourdough bread. So, when I rinse my mouth out, with my regular, first off, I, this is how I take care of my sour tongue. I put a little bit of water in a glass, put some salt in it, and put baking soda in it. Mix it up. Swish it all around in my mouth. Clean my tongue. And then I use the uh, Listerine. Well, it's green. Are blue and so my tongue turns blue because that white tongue grabs everything I guess anyway so I got some red mouthwash laborious fresh breath 125 I'll tell you how it works but anyway that uh, salt and, and then I do it again with the salt and bacon bacon um, soda and rinse real good and then my tongue turns back pink I don't know what causes it but food doesn't taste good nothing tastes good when you have that sour tongue so that's how I get rid of it so I got some batteries dollar twenty I guess they're dollar twenty five let me put my glasses on I only spent thirty dollars and eighty one cents now, let's see. Where's those batteries? Oh, here they are. A dollar twenty-five. Okay. And I got uh, two, four, six, eight. I like to keep batteries around. And then I got some more razors. I got the uh, five-blade razor for a dollar twenty-five, and there's. There's three in here. And we'll leave it there. Then I'm constantly having to wipe my hands while I'm putting my makeup on. So I got some antibacterial hand wipes for $1.25. I'm going to keep them up here. Oh, here's that lipstick. LA Colors Hydrating Lipstick in the color Sorbet. Let's give it a shot. Oh, it's pretty. Oh. Well.
I think it had to be warmed up a little bit before it would would spread. But it's pretty. Mm, those wrinkles were looking so much better. Well, they are looking better right in here. But not here. Oh, well, girls, what can I say? It's a pretty color. Okay. Put all that over there. Then, of course, you know, I got some more. Bacon soda. Bacon soda is what I put in there. And this will go right in my bathroom for my poor old tongue. Well, I can't give up the sourdough bread, girls. I've tried. Okay, now what's in this bag? Oh, I got some of these little scrubbers. We, me and Brenda both love them, so we use those. Then I got some little rubber sponges. I got two of these. Uh, good Lord, these are dryer sheets, aren't they? Yes. Comp dryer sheets, 18 sheets for $1.25. Reduces static, fast dry, wrinkled reduction. I got two of them. A dollar twenty-five each. I got some Kleenex for in here. Because I notice I'm probably the only one who uses a roll of toilet paper at all times in here. I got me one of my little favorite. These sponges from Dollar Tree are good. They're my favorite, really. They don't last very long, but I love them. What is this? Oh, I got some of those removable hooks. You know, you can put on your walls. And then you can just pull on this bottom part and pull it right off the wall. Don't fall on the floor. And then I got some window clean with vinegar. Dollar twenty-five. And Comet all-purpose cleaner with bleach. Now, what did I pay for this comment? Well, I guess $1.25. I didn't get anything that wasn't $1.25. Everything I got was $1.25. All right, let's put this stuff back in here because I'm running out of space. God, I don't even want to put the cupcakes up. I want to eat them. <laughs> I want to eat them right now. Now those got to stay in here. Yeah, but that doesn't. I stopped at the uh, Salvation Army. They were open. I didn't find anything. But they really are... Let me get down here on the floor so I'm losing the breath. Oh my god, I did try on a pair of pants, size 12. Girls, we have a problem. They were too tight. Size 12. I think they have the wrong size on them. Because I wear a 10. I'm not settled for that. Size 12. I mean, I couldn't. Usually I can lay on the bed and suck up and. No, I, I couldn't even do that. Now, I don't know if this is like Fabuloso, but it's lavender scented. Looks like Fabuloso, so we'll uh, kills the virus that causes COVID-19. 69% more. So, I got that. I got Sassy a toy. She won't even look at it. Look, sassy girl. Oh, fetch. Get it, girl. No, she snipped it. And she's still snipping it. She doesn't know what to do. 
Oh, no, she laid back down. She's not interested. Okay, and then I got these um, Epsom Salt uh, Lavender Magnesium Sulfate Crystals Calming Relaxing Lavender Set. Yeah. This is going to be wonderful. I'll be taking a bath in this tonight. Is that all? Yes. Okay, now I wanted to talk to you girls. I might as well do it today. I was going to talk to you about girdles. Well, now I really need to talk about girdles since I can't find any clothes that fit me. Yeah. What happens when you sit in there in your recliner and drink Cokes and eat potato chips and donuts all day? Anyway, I've got lots of experience at Gurgles. Let me go over. I should have got them out for you, but I didn't know I was going to talk about them. Let me go over here and get some. I don't want to show you what I did. When I was wearing girls. Oh, no. Sassy, why don't you like your toy? It likes you. Look. Beep, 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 beep. There you go. There you go. Get it, girl. Well, okay, don't then. Whatever. No, this. Okay, that. And I have this. And, uh, I'll be there in a minute, girls. I'm just looking up everything I'm going to need. Okay. Okay. Here's all the girls I can find. Okay. First thing I started doing was wearing these. Well, they don't stay up. They roll. And if you do keep them down far, uh, it makes your stomach look even bigger. So, as you can tell, these haven't been worn very much. Well, then, which ones? I got the, um, I got one like this. Oh, this is it. I got this thinking it would work well it's full size it's got room for your butt but it's got the snap in your crotch well, I don't like that I didn't like that at all because well I don't know about you but I need <laughs> I need my crotch to be so, this is what I came up with. And that one, this one, will give you a lot of fat right here where it ends. You'll get a, you'll get a bulge right there. All of them like this do it. I didn't like that bulge. So, what I ended up doing, I would put this on. And this one also holds your, uh, this comes under your bra, so it gives you a little lift. It's almost perfect. But, this crotch. 
So what I did was I folded that crotch under. And then I would use this corset. Now this corset starts here and comes all the way to your, God, I look fat in this blouse. Well, girls, I am fat. All the way to the bottom of your belly, your lower belly. Is that your gut? Your gut. And it keeps it flat. Now you gotta get the right size or you're gonna be very uncomfortable. This is the right size for me. And so then you put this on it flattened and then you put this on over it with this crotch folded under this keeps you from having that back fat back there so it's perfect this and this that's what you need yeah now I'll let you know how fat I am I should not have been this I love this blouse very comfortable but it makes me look fat as a pig. But anyway, is that all? Yes. So, there's your girdle information. If you don't want to roll the fat on your back, and you don't want to have a snaps between your legs, use that combination. Your stomach will be flat. You won't have back fat. Your boobs will be lifted. And you're ready to go. Only do it if you're going someplace special, girls. Other than that, don't do it. Anyway, I'm going to let you go. I'm going to go in there and watch ghost stories now and eat my uh, crunch and munch. And I'll see you in the morning. I love you. Bye.